Hello, there are several technologies that can detect and maintain a certain distance between a robot and a human. The most commonly used are ultrasonic sensors, infrared sensors, laser range sensor, voice and face recognition, camera sensors, etc. This time I will introduce you to the Arduino robot which uses a combination of ultrasonic and infrared sensors to track an object. The device is really very simple to build and very effective, so it can so it has been been presented several times on the internet. Most often these presentations in these presentations a servo motor is used to uh, which moves the ultrasonic sensor. Uh, this servo motor has not role in the operation of the robot except the visual art one at the beginning and complicates it unnecessarily. In my project I removed this servo in order to simplicity. The robot uh, consists uh, of several components uh, Arduino Uno microcontroller, L293D motor driver shield, uh, next uh, four pieces DC gear motors with wheels, uh, HC SR04 ultrasonic sensor module, two infrared sensor boards, and 7.4 volts lithium ion battery pack. To make it, we need only one rectangular plate on which lower side should be glued the engines and on the upper surface are mounted other elements. You can use this continued L293D mot uh, motor driver shield like in my case, but also an other fluid motor shield as is presented on the schematic diagram without any changes. The principle of the object dete detection and monitoring is based on data accepted by both sensors. The ultrasonic sen sensor detects the presence of an object in front of it within certain limits, in our case between 10 and 30 centimeters. If there is no object, for example, our hand in this space, all four engines are idle. At the moment when an object appears in this space, the data from the infrared sensors are read and based on obtained data, commands are given to the motors whereby the robots move in the desired direction. The distance to which the, the infrared sensors response is adjusted by a small trimmer trimming potentiometers. This distance should be adjusted so that it is slightly larger than the minimum distance to which the ultrasonic sensors is set to respond. In our case, it is more than 10, than 10 centimeters. Uh, and now let's see how the robots works in reality. The following is a brief description of how this device was made. 